hello guys welcome back to my channel so today we are going to make this cute little piglet so get your materials ready and let's get started okay so we're going to start with the magic ring so this is the body that we're going to make first and then we'll do six single crochets into the magic ring so we'll do one two three four five and six okay and then i'll place my marker over here Okay, so now in the second row, I'll increase every stitch around for a total of 12 stitches. Okay, so I'll increase. And increase the next stitch. Okay, and you'll increase all the remaining stitches. Okay, so now in the third row, we are going to do single crochet, then increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches. So we'll do single crochet and increase and repeat single crochet, increase. Okay, and repeat that all the way round. Okay, so now in the fourth row, we are going to do two single crochets, then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 24 stitches. So we'll do single crochet one, single crochet two, and increase, and repeat two single crochets, and increase, and repeat that all the way round. Okay, so now in the fifth row, we are going to do three single crochets, then increase and repeat all the way round for a total of 30 stitches. So we'll do single crochet, one, two, three, and then increase and repeat three single crochets. increase and repeat that all the way round ok 
okay so now after we are done with that now for the next 11 rows which is from row 6 until row 16 we are going to do single crochets all the way around in each row for a total of 30 stitches in each row okay so do single crochets until you get to the 16th row and then we'll do we'll start row 17 together Okay, so after the 16th row, this is how our little piglet looks like. So now, in the 17th row, we are going to start decreasing and we'll start by doing 3 single crochet, then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 24 stitches. So we'll do single crochet 1, 2, 3, and then decrease. and repeat three single crochets and decrease and keep repeating that all the way round Okay, so after that now in the 18th row, we are going to do two single crochets, then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 18 stitches. So we'll do two single crochets and decrease and repeat two single crochets, decrease and continue repeating that all the way round okay so now in the 19th row we are going to do single crochet then decrease and repeat that all the way round for a total of 12 stitches so we'll do single crochet then decrease and repeat single crochet decrease and continue repeating that all the way round Okay, so make sure you stuff your work fully now because uh, the next row will be our last row. Okay, and in this row, we are going to decrease all the way around six times for a total of six stitches. Okay, so we are going to decrease and we are going to keep decreasing all the way round. Okay, so after I get to the end, I'm going to remove the marker and then slip stitch in the next stitch. And then I'm going to cut off the yarn. Then after that, I'll do the finishing. So I'll just take a smaller crochet hook and 
pull the yarn through like that okay and then after that we'll make the nose okay so for the nose we'll start by doing a chain four so we'll do chain one two three and four and then starting in the second chain from the hook we're going to do single crochet in the first two chains And then in the last chain, we'll do four single crochets in the same chain. So single crochet, one, and then another single crochet, two, then another single crochet, three, and then one more single crochet in the same chain, four. Okay, and then turning to the other side, we are going to start by doing single crochet okay and then we'll do three single crochets in the next chain so we'll do single crochet one and then another single crochet in the same chain two and one more single crochet three okay and then now in the next row we are going to do single crochets all the way round okay so we'll continue and do single crochets Okay, and then after that I'm going to remove my marker slip stitch and cut off the yarn long enough for sewing okay and then now we'll make the legs okay so the legs are quite easy it's only three rows so we'll start by doing six single crochets into the magic ring so one two three four five and six okay so now in the second row we are going to increase every stitch around for a total of 12 stitches okay so increase And then increase the next stitch and increase all the remaining stitches okay so now in the third row which is the last row of the leg we are going to decrease all the way around for a total of six stitches so we are going to decrease and we'll decrease all the way round
Okay, after I get to the end, I'm going to remove my marker and then slip stitch. And cut off the yarn long enough for sewing. Okay, that's the way our leg looks like. So you stuff it a little bit when we are touching it. And then after that, we we'll make the ears. Okay, so for the ears, we are going to start with the magic ring and then six single crochets into the magic ring. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay, and then now in the second row, we are going to do single crochet, then increase and repeat uh, three times. Okay, so we're going to do single crochet, then increase in the next stitch. And repeat, single crochet, increase, and again, single crochet, and increase. Okay, so now in the third row, we are going to do two single crochet, then increase, and we are going to repeat that three times for a total of 12 stitches. So we'll do two single crochets and increase. And repeat two single crochets. increase and one more time two single crochets and increase okay so now in the fourth row which is the last row we are going to do single crochets all the way around for a total of 12 stitches so you're going to continue and do single crochets all the way until the end okay so after we get to the end i'm going to remove my marker and then slip stitch and cut off the yarn long enough for sewing. Okay, so after that, you make the other ear the same way, and then we'll attach all the parts together. Okay, so as you can see, I've already finished attaching all the parts together. So what I did first, I attached um, the nose, and for the nose, I attached it uh, at the one, two, three, at the third row or at the very center of the body. That's how I did it. And then I stuffed it a little bit. And for the ears, I, had, I counted one, two, three. And in the fourth row from the nose, that's where I attached the other ear. And then I counted one, two, three, four, five, and five stitches apart and then i attach the other ear okay so that's how it looks like and then i came down to the legs and from the nose i counted um one two three and in the fourth row from the nose that's where i attach my leg and make sure they are in line with the ear and on this other side too they're just two stitches apart 
and then from the first leg you count one two three and in the fourth row that's where you attach the other leg and this other one and make sure you stuff it too before attaching okay and now for the little tail over here it's quite easy to make so i did a chain nine and then starting in the second chain from the hook i did eight single crochets until the end and i attached it at the very end okay and then here for the little eyes i just counted uh from the nose or you can count from the ears one stitch i mean one row and then here you attach your eye over here just above the nose and this other one and there are one two three three stitches apart okay so guys this is our little pig that's how it looks like if you have any questions you can ask in the comments below and please check out my other videos until next time bye